What's up? Andrew Pollack, co-founder and CEO at leadpops.com. Doing another dartboard marketing video on our theme of lead funnels, talking all things lead funnels. Today we hit how to optimize your blog content. Love this topic. There's so much to do with a blog that most people are just not doing, putting in the work, creating the content, uploading it, they're driving traffic, they're sharing it on social. That's all good stuff. But if you haven't optimized your blog for lead conversion and you got people coming and reading your stuff and then they leave, what good is it, right? We don't wanna just create content and then cross our fingers and hope that people are gonna pick up the phone and call us when they're ready. It's kinda of like a hope and pray marketing strategy that really doesn't work too well. So with content, blog content, website content, any kind of content, we've got to take the time to optimize it for lead conversion. It's really easy. Buttons and links driving people to your lead funnels with a good call to action layered in throughout that content. An excellent example of this kind of strategy you'll find on themortgagereports.com. Really good visual, you can see for yourself how they have these really thorough guides, a lot of good content, and every couple of paragraphs, they're layering in call to action links that say things like, verify your mortgage eligibility, check today's mortgage rates, Find out how much home you can afford. They're just sprinkling these things into the content and when you click on them, that's where they pull you to the lead funnel. That starts collecting your information in a really smart, engaging kind of way. They've got banners, they've got buttons, they've got links layered in throughout their content so they get the most out of the readers that they get. They create the content, they drive traffic to it. Lots of different ways you can do that. Email blast, share it on social, drive traffic through different paid efforts, boosting that content. But again, now you've got people there and we've got to pull them into something that's gonna engage them and that's where the call to action links layered into that content make all the difference. So a couple ways to do it in the content itself, adding the call to action buttons and links throughout the content. Just think about every so often as I scroll, I wanna keep those call to action links, pulling people to that lead form in my content and then in the sidebar, really good opportunity to optimize that sidebar as well. All too often I'll just see something like, a link of, of archives that'll like take you back to all the blog posts you've ever written since the beginning of time. Maybe have a little section for that in that column, but don't make the entire column a waste of space. There's a good opportunity to embed a lead funnel, a nice little quote form right there in that sidebar, a couple banners that you can add for different calls to action that are relevant to the blog content. So hey, find out how much home you can afford, click here. See how much money you can save click here, right? Couple different options, purchase, refinance, a quote form. So now I've got three different opportunities to capture leads in my side column and something to let them sign up to receive updates when new blogs are uploaded would be smart. It's a way to collect email addresses and grow your list for future marketing efforts. So optimize the blog for, for all the effort you're putting into it. It's definitely worth the extra little effort to make sure you're getting leads from those visitors, the people that are coming to consume your content. Otherwise they come, they read your stuff, they're more educated, they leave, and somebody else gets a better lead because of your content. So make sure you're maximizing uh, your results by just adding these call to action that are pulling people to these lead funnels. Again, great example, check out themortgagereports.com. At Lead Pops, we also offer a fully optimized blog service where we create the articles. We have expertly written articles and content we create for you. We upload it to your blog. Then we optimize the heck out of this stuff. We basically build you your very own version of the mortgage reports that's updated consistently every month for you with that content and it's done the right way because it's highly optimized for lead conversion. So you can do this stuff yourself or you can hire the experts at Lead Pops to take care of it for you. We know what we're doing. Uh, if you're interested, go to leadpops.com to learn more about this service. If you like this content, if you think it's interesting, if you think it's helpful, please comment, share, and I'll catch you soon with another video.